pretty obvious the biggest challenge is their, their speed and their tempo. Um, we've been doing 16 seconds between plays. We've had periods where we do hurry ups and um, we're really getting our conditioning in this week and it's it's been a tough two days, but just getting lined up and getting the play call in time when they're going fast is going to be the biggest challenge. As you look at their offense, do you see some of <coughs> um, I think we're more execution based and we'll, yeah, we're more focused on uh, actually beating your man and beating your guy on a route or something like that. But um, they're, they're, they're more based on fatigue and really really tiring us out, which works very well for them. They're very, very talented at that uh, aspect of the game, and they just wear people out, and by the end of the game, they're, they can't even go. Other than the jerseys, probably <laughs> probably have faster offenses. What do you... Uh, the yeah, probably. What do you uh, see when you look across the uh, sideline? See Marcus Mariota over there. Um, I mean, the best player in college football. He's obviously a Heisman Heisman winner, and he's very talented in the run game. And he he just makes good decisions. He's a tall, tall, physical guy, and can run the ball and just and pass just as well. Does he create fear at all? Um, I wouldn't say we're f scared of any anybody really. Just. We gotta we gotta pay attention where he is at all times and what he's doing at all times. Obviously. Along those lines, I mean, you say you're not afraid of anyone. You face Melvin Gordon, you face Lamar Jackson. Is there something cool about the fact that you guys are gonna go up against the three Heisman? Yeah, yeah. Uh, I mean, if we could shut him down like we did the last two, that'd be awesome. And just a big feat for our defense, and I think it'd prove a lot. Joey, where have you improved the most? Defensive lineman this year. I've said this a couple times that I think I've improved, improved the most as in not as much my my play as much as playing for the guy next to me and playing for my team and uh, I think that helps me play that much harder and um, with how close our team is I think that's I think that's a thing with all of us on the D line now and we're playing much harder for each other. Is there a reason that that changed, do you think? Something you can pinpoint? Um, Coach Johnson's a big, big part of it. He's brought us so close together, and uh, we care so much about him that we'll play just as hard for him. Jerry, a lot of you guys talked about how physical that Alabama game was. How, from a mental and physical standpoint, how do you use this week to prepare? Is some pressing yeah. having to play another game after yeah. the game? I mean, it's completely different. Oregon and Alabama are completely different animals. Um, Alabama's line up and come at you, big physical guys, and Oregon's run across the field and spread you out and tire you out. So both are both are tough and both are definitely tiring. And um, we're just preparing as well as we can. And with the tempo and the speed of practice has been up, been kicked up a lot this week. So uh, it's just a just a mental mental battle having to prepare the, and going into our 15th game of the season it's a grind but you know, yeah, we're, 